Creating a church budget should not have to be hard. That's why we made our budgeting feature in Church Track really easy to use, not to mention super fast. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a budget in Church Track from start to finish. I'm also going to show you a couple of really neat features that will save you time when it comes to your church budgeting. Now, before you can create your budget in Church Track, you need to set up your accounting categories. To do this, you have to go to the accounting screen and go to categories. If you have not created your income and expense categories in the program yet, I recommend you checking out our setting up accounting videos as well as our creating categories videos first. You can find those videos and more on our YouTube channel or directly from our online user guide. It's a great tool. Once you've set up your accounting categories, you can start creating your budget on the accounting screen. Again, right down from categories, select the blue button that says budgets. Go to the actions tab and the only option under there that you get to use first is create a new budget. Go ahead and give your budget a name. Set your start date. This can be your physical year or your fiscal year, whichever you're planning for, it does not matter. Now, the next step is to add your income and expense categories that you've created. Everything you want included in your budget. Here's a pro tip to speed up this process. You can use the actions button to select all categories and then uncheck the ones you don't want to use, okay? The second option that you have is to go in and check off the categories that you actually want in your budget. This is tedious and time consuming, so I don't recommend this. It's easier to check off all categories, create the budget, and then just remove what you don't want. Once all of your categories are in place, then go down and select create budget, and you're one step closer to being done with your church budget. Now, once your budget is created, you have got to go in then and put your uh, categorical amounts. What is your budget going to be? You can do this in two ways as well. You can click on the category, which opens a slider, and enter your budget amount here. Or you can go back to the Actions button and click edit this budget and that gives you a screen that you can just scroll through and quickly add all of the designated amounts for your budget for each category. Once you're complete, you simply scroll to the bottom and click close and you're done. Pretty simple, right? Now, here are a couple of tips to help you get the most out of budgets. One, to generate budget reports, you're going to go to the actions button and Scroll down to the budget reports option. Here you're going to have multiple options for reports that you can either generate to a PDF or export to a CSV file so you can view it in a spreadsheet program like Excel. Second, for budget items that only happen on a specific month or time period, like VBS for example, you can choose a budget item period, select the option that you want, select the starting time. Like example, we only select, I mean, we only take donations from April to June for VBS. Once I've set that, I close it, and that sets that up in my budget. Three, when it's time to create your budget next year, it is likely that it will be similar to your current budget. Creating your budget is as easy as cloning it. This can be done with any budget and church track in seconds. All you do is select the budget that you want to choose to utilize, we're going to use this one I just created. Go to the Actions button and clone this budget. When you say OK, the budget will then pop into place and all you have to do is update the name, update the start date, be sure you do this, and update your categories the amounts that you are set up for your budget. And if there's anything in this budget that you don't need, you simply uncheck it and it goes away. Then you can use this as a means for creating budgets for following years and it's faster. Yay! And that's Budgets and Church Track. So to learn more about other features, be sure to check out our online user guide. It's filled with hundreds of articles with step-by-step -step instructions, as well as helpful videos. And if you need additional help creating your church budget, do not hesitate to reach out to us by creating a support ticket or scheduling a phone call. We are always here to help. Happy budgeting.